went out for the day today and I might have done some damage. <laughs> Hello, that's my name and Tori here. How are we? Hope you're all doing well. So I popped in to Primark today and I will be entirely honest with you. I purchased all of the Winnie the Pooh items in there that I don't already have. It's a big bag, we have a bit to go through. So I think without further ado, let's get on with the haul. <laughs> so first off, I'll start with the first and only bit of non-clothing. So as I'm sure most of you are aware because it's been taking like Instagram and TikTok by storm, Primark have started selling their own range of Disney munchlings. They do miniature versions of the plushies, there's like stationery, there's water bottles, all that kind of stuff. And I got the eel plushie. So at the moment, I obviously can't speak for anything in the future, but at the moment, eel is the only plushie out of the Winnie the Pooh gang they are doing at Primark. And he's in his little like blueberry muffin form, which I thought was really cute. And I was so happy that they did have him because in my Winnie the Pooh collection, I have a few, I have two munchling items. They're both obviously Winnie the Pooh. And I haven't actually got the Eeyore Munchling from, you know, the actual Disney store because he's only available in the mystery packs. And if you know anything about me, I don't really like to risk my luck with mystery packs. So when I saw Primark were doing these, I was like, of course I need to get Eeyore so that I can have him in my collection. And they have just got on the label here, the other ones you can get. So there's Rainbow Candy Mickey, Cinnamon Bun Mickey, Lollipop Cheshire Cat, Blueberry Muffin Eeyore, Candy Apple Mickey, however his picture, Candy Apple Mickey's picture is blacked out, so I don't know what that's about, I don't know if he's a rare one or whatever. Glazed Cookie Donald, Strawberry Birthday Cupcake Mini, Pineapple Cake Stitch, Candy Twist Marie, and Chocolate Truffle Dale. So they're all the ones that you can get at the moment at Primark and the label does say Disney Munchlings at Primark. And yeah, these are just the small little plushies and this was £4.50. As I said, the rest of it is all clothing. There is one pyjama item and then the rest are like jumpers and t-shirts. So I think I'll dig out the pyjama bit next. We all know I love a good Winnie the Pooh pyjama. I mean, they're mainly what I film my videos in. And I love, I love nighties. They're my preferred item to sleep in. I just find them so comfy. And I've never seen this one before, so I had to get it. It's got the whole gang on it there and it's even got R Tigger is hugging Rue which I thought was cool because Rue isn't usually featured on much merch so I was really happy about that it's in this really bright yellow and it says you got this I thought it was really cute so yeah how much was this this was eight pounds okay and then onto the t-shirt I got this one I've seen people on Instagram with before so it's not a new release but this is just the first time I saw it. And also it made a difference because I didn't go to my local store. So this store had so much more than my local has. So I was very happy about that. Yeah, this one isn't new, it's been out for a while. I just got very lucky to find it because my local doesn't do anything good. And it is this t-shirt with, look how cute that is. It's like a, almost like a watercolor painting style, like very sketchy style. Do you see what I mean? It's a t-shirt, but I have, I have some people sizing up and getting it as like a t-shirt dress, but I got it in a size large, which is my normal size at Primark. It's 14 to 16 UK. So yeah, I just thought that would be really, really cute. And I really like the colour. It's a very... When she scanned it through the till, it came up as Winnie the Pooh oatmeal t-shirt. I mean, yeah, if I had to pick a colour that this is, I guess oatmeal makes sense. Yeah, I just thought it was a very different colour to have as a t-shirt. I thought it went really well with Pooh. So yeah, and how much was this? This was six pounds. And in case you don't know, I'm not a summer girly at all. I think you know that from my videos. I make that quite clear. I don't do well in heat. I am an autumn winter girl. Cardigan weather, jumpers, that's me. That's what I like. And I'm ready for autumn now, as you're about to see. <laughs> First up, this. This is a new item I have seen on Instagram. It's only been out like a couple of weeks. But as per usual, my local didn't have it. <laughs> and it is just this jumper. Again, I think they're calling this an oatmeal color. Okay. 
and it's got the main four on the front and they're all like organizing and putting into place the word poo i really like that and it's in the same sort of style as the t-shirt where it's like a painty sketchy style which i really like again i got this in a size large uk 14 to 16 and this was 10 pound <laughs> another jumper and this one it's too cute look at it it's yellow it's got Pooh's cheeky face and then in pink it has honey and i just absolutely loved that the writing is in pink because obviously pink's my favorite color and yellow is a very prominent color on tori in wonderland just because it like symbolizes poo so i always think pink and yellow is like tori in wonderland colors i loved that they did the writing of this in pink it just felt like even more me that's another jumper again in the same size and how much was this one this was nine pounds and the last thing i picked up i didn't see this at first it was tucked around like the other side from everything else like, yeah it, it would make sense to me if like on their jumper stack table like the two poo jumpers would be together and like this was on the jumper stand as well it was just around the other side like why not put them all together <laughs> I don't know, I don't know their system. But this was tucked around the other side and it wasn't until my friend that I went with was going to try some things on in the changing rooms and I was just like dawdling around in the area while I waited for her and it was literally like this how I saw it and I was like, is that Tigger? So I had to go and unfold it. And it is, it's a big Tigger. I think this is like their new collection at the moment because he's literally in the same style as like the t-shirt and the other jumper where it's like i want to call it watercolor but where it's like a sketchy style but like not perfectly filled in that's what i'm gonna go with and then it says disney's winnie the pooh up the top and to make a difference from the last two this is a hoodie got the two little drawstrings and nice orange hood again i got this in a size large and this was the most expensive item of the of the haul coming in at 12 pounds do you remember a time when I was scared of wearing orange because I didn't want it to clash with my pink? And now look at me. Look how, she, how she's grown. I don't care if it clashes, it makes me happy. Tigger makes me happy, Winnie the Pooh makes me happy. If the orange is gonna clash, I don't care. <laughs> Simple. So yeah, um, a hoodie and two jumpers. I am ready for autumn. I'm ready and also July here in England has it's been lovely for me everyone else has been complaining about it it's been like lower 20s like I think right now it's like how I'm just filming a TikTok so my phone is literally still in the holder uh where is it it's 19 degrees right now it's I'm filming this on July 31st it's so it's literally August tomorrow and it's a cloudy grey sky day and it's cool i'm happy i'm loving it it's rained most of this week i'm happy i'm loving it <laughs> if you watch my videos from earlier on in the summer when, some, when we were having a heat wave you knew i wasn't having a good time now i'm having a great time and shops are bringing out their autumn range it's a good time to be me i will say <laughs> uh, everyone's like saying oh i hope august picks up so it's more summery no no, we had our like two week heat wave. We're done. Let's keep this weather please England. I'm liking this. <laughs> okay, that's enough weather talk. Anyway, yeah, that is everything I picked up in Primark. So they did have more Winnie the Pooh items, but everything else I already have. Oops. <laughs> yeah, that was literally everything that they have new that I don't already have. And when it comes to Winnie the Pooh, I have no control. So I was literally rummaging through and finding things in a size large and then just putting it in my basket without like having a second thought about it because I have no control when it comes to Winnie the Pooh. But what's new? <laughs> yeah, that was everything I picked up on my little trip to Primark today. Let me know what was your favorite item that I picked up in the comments section down below. I'm so excited for like jumper weather to come around. I mean, it's going to be coming pretty soon if the weather stays like this. So I can't wait to start wearing the jumpers. I can't wait to style the t-shirt. I finally have an eel munchling. So I didn't have to wait for the mystery packs because 
Mystery packs are just a lot of work to get what you want. Um, he's not centered like the Disney Store ones are, but that's okay. His eel, his everything we want and more. If you enjoyed this video, please do pop that thumbs up button. And if you'd like to see more from what, do click subscribe down below. While you're down there, don't forget to ding the notification bell. You might as well. You're already down there. And I'll see you guys real soon. Bye!